Welcome back, everybody, and we're lucky enough to have Holly, our nutrition queen, here. Thank Thanks you. very much for joining us. Now, I have uh, taken up the Smart Body Corporate Challenge, mm -hmm. and I'm really interested in how I can actually get uh, well, get very good at this over the next five weeks and beat yes. some of my friends, including Mark Wally Eustace, who's involved in this as well. Of course. Um, tell me about this the food out of 10, the scoring. How does this work? Perfect. So each day we do encourage um, everybody to track their food. And at the end of the day, I rate their food in terms of their intake, um, balancing out all of their macros being the fats, the protein and the carbohydrates. So that's also very important. We want to assure across the board you're balancing your meals. You're not uh, going too long between the meals. We want regular intervals of consuming food uh, as long as well as keeping up your hydration. Okay, so, so good. Now, of course, hydration is important. Uh, well, let's say yesterday my food, mm -hmm. I had uh, Vegemite and toast, mm -hmm. one of the Australian staples in the morning. Yes. A nice healthy chicken and salad sandwich for lunch. Perfect. And then uh, a nice piece of steak and some chips and a salad for uh, dinner. So Beautiful. what's my scoring out of 10 for that, do you think? I would say there you're looking you're looking at about a seven out of ten. There oh. are a few improvements to be made, um, I know the I know you're but talk you can about always the chips. you can always improve. But that's okay. So it's a good starting point. It's nice to see that you have got regular eating habits. You're having breakfast. Um, a lot of people will skip breakfast, so it's yeah, that's a good start. Definitely. Excellent. Now, carbs. Mm -hmm. Everybody talks about carbs. Yes. There's good carbs and bad carbs. Yes. Is that correct? That that is very correct. Yes. What's the difference? So your good carbs are going to fuel your body. Uh, you'll find you'll feel fuller for longer. Um, you're going to look for things like uh, the high fiber content in your good carbohydrates, uh, which, and again, will also provide you with the additional proteins. So looking at your whole grain breads, um, your brown rice, quinoa, all these things are quite can, high in carbohydrates. I can never say that, quinoa. It's quinoa, really it is a big one to wrap your head around. Now, um, protein, protein, very important. Yes. Definitely. Yeah, you've mentioned that. Now, you've got uh, some success with your protein bites, is that correct? Yes, so I do have a full range of uh, protein balls. They are vegan product um, and they're enriched with all of your superfood powders as well. So you're getting quite a vast uh, variety of nutrients as well as a good uh, healthy snack, uh, providing you with about eight grams of protein per serve. So that's quite substantial um, coming from a vegan protein, yes. Fantastic. Now we've got a couple of examples of uh, the food in front of us, is that mm -hmm. correct? Yes, we do. We certainly do. What have we got here? So over to your right, we have a bowl of whole, whole grain oats. Um, and through that, we have mixed a whey protein. Um, so that is obviously going to help keep you fuller. From there, we've topped it with some healthy fats. So you've got a teaspoon of peanut butter along with some chia seeds. So again, your chia seeds are full of all your omegas. Um, going to contribute to nice skin, hair, and the list goes on there. So something like that would be the perfect option. Uh, say pre-gym, pre, uh, if you're working out in the mornings, you could also just have it if you're straight off to work. You do want to stay nice and full. Uh, you don't want the sugar spike coming up and then crashing down right. a few hours later if you were to have uh, jam on toast or something similar. Fantastic. And so, this lovely looking salad. And then over to your left, we've got a brown rice uh, with a basil pesto stirred through. Um, with some rocket and greens. So again, you're getting, you're getting a nice small serve, not too large of a serve of the brown rice. And then you're getting uh, beautiful, you're getting the olive oil in the basil pesto, uh, your fats, and then you've got all of your green vegetables for your fibre component there. So. Fantastic, and I'm gonna prove these just weren't made yesterday and put in the no, fridge. These are, these are, certainly these are, now not. Now let's see how I go. <laughs> I'm sure I won't make a, a terrible Please face. enjoy, please enjoy. Mm. So again, these are all very quick and easy recipes you can do. Mm. Um, we're either that morning or as well as I'm not going to say any more. <laughs> no, that's really nice, fantastic, Wonderful. and very fresh. Thank you. Well, I'm not a big uh, peanut man, but that mm -hmm. is really nice with you the enjoy? peanut butter. Fantastic. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. It can always be done. <laughs> well, Holly, thank you very much for the information. That's uh, fantastic, and it'll be uh, great for see how people, how I go, and how other people go. I'm with sure the corporate you'll challenge. do just fine. <laughs> thank you very much, Holly. Lovely to speak with you. Thank